We've got another Pride Martial Arts drill for the Century Bob. There's going to be a four punch combo. It's going to be one, two, hook, hook. Hooks are going to be to the body. So we're going to stand tall, keep the chin down, gloves up. It's going to be one, two, hook, hook. Okay? On those hooks, we're going to drop down a little bit. You never want to stand tall and throw down low going for a hook to the body. Always think about the distance that your glove is leaving your face. I always teach my students jaw to jaw. In other words, jaw to jaw from my jaw to his jaw. Short distance, right? I never want to drop my hand and then throw that punch to his jaw longer distance, right? So short, sharp punches. So this combo is one, two, hook, hook, okay? These aren't shovel hooks, these are just natural hooks to the body, okay? Fist here, elbow comes up, leave the jaw to the body, leave the jaw to the body, okay? Nice and relaxed, one, two, three, four. Tearing up those ribs. The beauty of the Century Bob is just the anatomy of it. If I was doing this drill on a heavy bag, I could throw the same drill, but here I really feel that I'm connecting with those ribs. So this is a real good drill to do on the Century Bob. So in this drill, we're setting up the two body shots. We're coming in intelligently. We're throwing the one, two, and coming in to land those body shots, okay? So we're giving them a lot to deal with by coming in with that one, two, and then dropping down with those body shots. Always want to watch your head movement when you're throwing that combo. You want to see your head moving, moving, moving. See, when a fighter throws and moves his head while he's throwing, he makes for a hard target. So that's something to keep in mind. You never want to be too stiff. You don't want to be here, 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 here. Head isn't moving. You want to move the head. Boom. Dig into the body, okay? So this is a way that you could really step forward and get in on the inside. And using the Century Bob, we could target real nicely. We could target the nose, the jaw, ribs, ribs, okay? Nice and relaxed. Use good technique. This is a really good drill for the Century Bob. I hope you guys use this drill. Hope you like the video. Be sure to subscribe to Prime Martial Arts. We'll be doing weekly videos of drills on the Century Bob.